Welcome to another video. If you are new to this channel, we welcome you. In this video, we are going to look at how we can overlay a video inside a text, just like what they do in After Effects, DaVinci Resolve, Adobe Premiere Pro, and other software that you can overlay a video inside the text. With the new node editor in Olive 0.2, it's still in alpha version, we can do exactly the same thing, just like the intro that you have just seen. Let's dive in now and see how we can overlay a video inside a text using the new node editor in Olive 0.2. Here I have created a sequence, imported a video also into the timeline. So let's go straight to the node editor. In a node editor, you right click in the node editor, go to filter and show all to show all the nodes that are attached to the timeline. Now we need the uh, text node generator and a matte node so that we can add the text to the video clip to be displayed on the sequence viewer. So let's right click in the node editor, go to add generator and text. Let's add another node which is the matte node. I right click, add matte and matte. Now we need to connect the text into the top value of the matte node. So hold on control, click on the node and drag it to the top value. And we do the same on the video track with the clip. Hold on control, click on the video track and bring it into the bottom value. Now let's expand the viewer. When we expand the viewer, you can see that the video track is connected to the text. And that is why we can see the video track on the uh, sequence viewer. We have a video on how to understand the node in the new node editor of Olive 0.2. So link up here. You can watch that video to understand how you can use the node. So here we need to delete this uh, uh, input of the video track. So selecting that and delete. So when we do that, you can see that there is no video displayed. Now that we have connected the text into the med node with the video clip, on the video track into the med node let's connect the output into the input of the texture so hold on control click on the med node and drag it to the texture when we do that you can see that our text is displayed with the video in the sequence viewer so let's uh, change the properties of the text by coming to the parameter editor and to, into the text property change the text we can also change the font style by selecting a thicker font and change the font size to 300. Now that we are done with the property of the text, let's see how we can overlay the video into the text. Well, the matte node help us to do that. So let's select the matte node, come to the physical property of the matte node, which is under the parameter editor. And in the method, you can see that we have add, subtract, multiply, divide, and power. Now, when we select subtract, it subtracted the video from the sequence viewer. But when we select multiply, it's multiplied after two value and give us the result of what we want to achieve. That is to overlay the video clip into the text. So let's play that by coming down to the timeline and play and see. So you can see that the video is playing inside the text which we have overlaid the video inside the text thank you for watching and if you are new to this channel please do consider subscribing so that when we upload new videos you can be notified thank you again